Hello future makers, welcome to Teacher Prenya. It's said that teaching is one fourth preparation and three fourth theater. No matter how good your interview went, if your demo class doesn't go well, it's of no use. A demo lecture is a small lecture that you take in front of the supervisors or in the class in the presence of a supervisor to exhibit your confidence and your teaching style. Most of the student teachers are afraid of a demo class, but not anymore because teacher Pranayam is here on how to give a demo class for teaching intern. Make sure you watch the whole video till the end and don't forget to subscribe to teacher Pranayam because we have a huge surprise coming for you as soon as we reach 20,000 subscribers. Now without wasting time, just let's get started. First of all, have a very formal and presentable look while you enter the class. Always keep a smiling face and enter the lecture with a lot of patience and confidence. Patience because kids or supervisors can ask you questions in the middle of a demo lecture and confidence because you have to tell yourself that whatever comes in my way, I will face it. Next, you have to plan your whole demo lesson right from the start to the end. How you will have an interesting start, what activity you will carry through, how you will use your board, what you will write on board, how will you end the class, what homework are you going to give, what teaching learning material you need to take. Everything needs to be properly planned right before you have to plan taking a demo class. If you are given the topic by the supervisor, you will have to teach that only. But if you are not given a topic, do choose the topic that you are the most confident with and you have the most knowledge about. This will really help you boost your demo lecture in a very effective manner. Once you've planned the whole demo lecture in your mind, practice the whole demo lecture at least twice in front of the mirror and do give the same demo lecture in front of a senior teacher or one of your teacher friend who can honestly give your feedback on it. First, when you enter the class, greet everybody and use the first 5 to 10 minutes to bond with the children. Interact with them and make them used to the classroom environment so that you also get enough time to get adjusted to the environment and even the students can absorb that a new person has come in and we have to learn from her. A very important tip is that whenever you are giving a demo lecture, act as if you are a real teacher and teach as if you are teaching your own class as if you are already a teacher in that school because if you don't do it that way, children are very smart to realize that you are a demo lecture, there's a supervisor at the back and they will create mischief in the class. So you also need to make it very clear in the start of your class by giving instructions that are proper, clear and disciplinary and follow the same instructions throughout the class. You need to make the class as interesting and as interactive as possible from your end. A small and effective rule is to use the 80-20 rule where 80% of the interaction is done from the kids and only 20% of the talking and interaction is done from you. For this, you can use as many engaging questions as possible and try and involve and relate to whatever the kids are saying and go through the flow of the class. This will ensure the supervisor that you are confident and you can deal with all kinds of kids. Have a very clear voice and effective expressions while teaching to your class. For example, if there's a question mark, use it that way. If there's a full stop, you take a pause. Or if there's something that you have to stress on, stress on it while talking during the lecture. One very important tip is to use kids, beta or bacha during the class and make them very comfortable in your class. Also, make sure that you use as many adjectives as possible for anybody who's trying to engage or give answers to your questions with very good bacha or some beta. That's an amazing answer, dear. This way, the classroom teaching learning process becomes very smooth. Your speed while talking should neither be too fast or too slow. It should be enough for anybody to understand what you're trying to say. Especially for a demo lecture, you must take a teaching learning material. And a teaching aid should be legible enough and big enough so that everybody in the class can see the teaching learning material. The teaching aid should also be very interesting and should actually make an impression that it's supposed to make on the supervisor and it should show your creativity as well as expression in that short span of 30 minutes. Thank you for watching the whole video. At the end, I would only like to tell you that whenever you're giving a demo lecture, you give your 100%. But make sure that when you demo mein pass ho kar teaching, ke liye select ho jai, तब जब आप पढ़ाने जाएंगे तो पीछे सुपरवाइजर्स नहीं होने के बावजूद आपको अपना उतना ही बेस्ट देना है हर दिन तब जाकर आप एक बहुत अच्छी टीचर बने
If you have any more doubts regarding a demo lecture, you can ping me on Instagram or comment down below. I'll make sure I answer all of your queries. If you think the video was worth it, share it with your teacher friends and family and subscribe to Teacher Premium for more such videos. See you soon.